Wipe here, and today we're going to be talking about one of my new favorite Destiny 2 subclass updates, the Solar Week. And what we have here is Bottom Tree Sunbreaker. And if you don't know, on this subclass, you create sunspots with ability kills. Your super kill, your grenade kill, or your melee kill when they're charged. That being said, the sunspot plants a sunspot on the ground that increases your ability re regen out of the roof you get insane amounts of grenade wall and melee energy back on top of that you get a damage buff of i believe 20 percent and as you see here a 20 percent damage buff does a lot um i'll show you right here kill no type with a melee it drops the sunspot my auto is doing 22 from here normally it only does 19. So that's a pretty good buff but where it really stacks is Bum, bum, bum. You can body shot with most guardians and high impact sniper. So that leads to say, hey, what the hell? There was a sunspot over there. They just buffed hammer. So now with every kill on a guardian, they drop a sunspot every time you kill a guardian. So what you can do is, I'm right now using the old trial sniper because it has slide shot. What you can do is, I put the 10 second boots on so I get better empowerment and I body somebody and I go jump into the sunspot and I just kill everybody except this guy who has slightly too much armor. And literally they just continually spawn sunspots. There's even a sunspot in the air. Like what? Not to mention besides the fact that I can one shot everybody with this, like look at my grenade recharge. You know, and I just current. I'm just constantly just running over these sunspots, just railing people. And it doesn't have to be a snipe. I could kill him with this auto. He'll still drop a sunspot. He usually drops me some special. Literally no skill whatsoever involved. All I have to do is hope for the best and then step in the sunspot. And it is actually the most insane thing I've ever seen. Not to mention the sunspots deal damage themselves, so if anybody steps in the special ammo on the ground, they will literally just burn themselves. It's insane. It's insane. And it continually gives me 10 seconds of a buff. Oh my god. Oh boy. Chai with Recluse. I don't even need to try it with Recluse. It doesn't even matter. Anything I do to kill you, you'll drop a sunspot. Just like that. It's... It's insane. I'm definitely gonna be trying this out for a while and see how it goes. It's just it's just gonna make it like too easy It's like it's literally too easy. I don't even understand the best best part about all of this is these boots These boots give you Phoenix cradle which actually buffs your teammates as well. So every time I pop a, a Sunspot on the ground uh, my teammates will get the same buff as myself and this does work I should have put it in clash so that I could show you but it does work with teammates if I buff my teammates at least in PvE they were also dropping sunspots with kills so bottom tree sunbreaker is bottom tree sun broken officially and I was pretty mad that they buffed dawn blades but this is some next level shit like I just slide over into the sunspot and I just continue just continue rolling on fools. 10 seconds of this. Like, before I have to recharge. <laughs> what? Oh my god. This game sometimes. Well, and on top of everything, I will actually have... Uh, what is it? Solar coil now? The... What is this here? Solar Plexus. Increased damage for all solar ability melee abilities. Gains super energy from finishers. Okay, so that doesn't matter. But in PvP, I'll also have increased solar melee damage. This is definitely Season of the Sun, if I've ever seen it. What a winter, huh? Uh, thank you for watching. Make sure you hit the like button. Comment below what you think, if there's anything more broken. Uh, I know people have been saying Dynamo, maybe Void, uh, Battery, who knows. But... Thanks for watching. Hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, and check out for more content. I'll catch you guys later. <laughs>